Hi everyone, Petal is less here. Welcome back to my channel. I'm coming on today to share with you a wall art decor that I'll be making. My daughter asked me to, you know, make her something nice for her room because she wants to refresh her room for 2018. Yeah, she wants to change up her decor in her room. So I said, sure, I'll help you with some items. So let's get in to what I'll be using to do this DIY today, you guys. Okay, I have this canvas board here. It's 16 by 20 and I got it from Dollarama. But you know, you can find canvas boards at Michael's, your art store, stuff like this. And I have these gold leaf, you guys. Yeah, metallic gold leaf flakes. And I have um, these rhinestones, new rhinestones I found at Dollarama. And the gold leaves are all from, also from Dollarama, sorry. And I got these wall stickers from the Dollar Tree. I got three of them. <laughs> Two leaves and one with the hearts. And I have some white acrylic paint. And we have our Mod Podge. And our tools that we'll be using, our glue gun. All right, you guys, let's get started. Okay, I'm gonna start off by painting my canvas board white. I need the background white. And I know the canvas is white, you guys, but I like a nice clean finish. You could see the little lines and stuff on the canvas that it's made with. So I just like to add paint to give it a nice smooth, clean finish. This is optional. You don't have to do this part if you don't want to. Now we're going to take our Mod Podge and our wall stickers and add them to the canvas. And I'm going to use the Mod Podge on the back just so it sticks and doesn't come off. I know it comes with a sticker, but in time it can lift. So I'm just using the Mod Podge to hold it down. And now for our gold leaf. <laughs> sticker the same thing just add the Mod Podge all around the back you can use glue the glue gun if you want but I'm tired of the strings all the time you guys so I'm using the Mod Podge wherever I can use it I'll use it <laughs> and when you apply the the sticker please press it out completely because you'll get air bubbles just you know smooth it out and then the air bubbles will be gone all right, everyone, now we're going to use the Mod Podge and put down our gold flakes, our gold leaf flakes. I'm using the Q-tips to press it down because if you use your fingers, it's even when you're taking it up, it sticks to your fingers. So to press it down to make sure it's sticking to the Mod Podge, I'm using Q-tips, you guys. This is my first time using gold leaf and it looks good. I like it. I really like it. It's a little... Uh, messy to use because it sticks to your fingers and stuff, but it's fun. I like it and I like the effect that it's giving me so far. It looks really nice. And as you're placing it down, just use small patches of Mod Podge. Don't um, use a lot because it will dry on you. So just use small chunks, small patches, sorry as you go along and just place them down and add more as you need it and now I'll be adding some gems I just arranged them in the pattern that I like and I'm just gonna glue them down yes with the glue gun <laughs> I'm using the glue gun now you guys and here's the finished look you guys I love how the gold leaf effect turns out it's really nice I enjoyed working with it and I think it looks very nice Okay, now, the two hearts that I did in the middle, um, well, towards the end, let me show you how I'm going to place them on the wall so you can see. 
they're going to be one slightly above the other and then you'll see the with love yeah <laughs> i want to hang them one one higher than the other so this is the effect you'll get and i think it looks very nice what do you think like i said before i like the gold leaf effect metallic gold leaf it's very nice gold leaf flakes yeah and I love these um, wall stickers from the Dollar Tree. They're very nice. And my blinged out gems. I like how it turned out. I think it's going to look super cute on her wall. <laughs> Alright everyone. I hope I've inspired you with another lovely DIY for you to do. You know, this is very nice. You can hang it in an office, in your bedroom, uh, even in your living area, wherever you choose to. It's a lovely piece of wall decor. <laughs> Thank you for coming on and seeing the DIY that I did today. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already, so you can come back and see more of the DIYs that I have for you guys. <laughs> All right, everyone. Remember, as always, Stay blessed from Petal is blessed. Bye bye. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just need you back. <laughs>